Hey everyone, I'm Tim with Auto Robotics. In this episode, we're gonna go over the LED indicators and what each sequence means. Your X-Star has four lights located under each motor. Knowing what these lights are telling you will help you avoid issues, fly better, and take full advantage of everything the X-Star offers. This information can also be found on page five of your user manual. So let's get right into it. First, we will turn on the remote and the aircraft. The front lights will almost always be red, indicating the nose of the aircraft. The rear lights are for the status of the aircraft and will change depending on the situation. When you first start your aircraft, lights will flash red and yellow for the initialization before going into the warm-up procedure. Flashing green and red indicates the IMU is warming up. You do not want to move the aircraft during this procedure. Once the aircraft is ready, the rear lights will change to a flashing green only, telling you that the X-Star is in either GPS mode or the start point positioning system is working properly. If the rear lights are slowly flashing yellow, this lets you know that the aircraft is not in GPS mode and the start point positioning system is not functioning properly, such as ATTI mode. When the LEDs become solid yellow, the aircraft is experiencing magnetic interference. You will need to shut down or land the aircraft, move to a new location, and recalibrate the compass. The lights will also change depending on the battery status. A low battery level of 25%, or what you have set in the Starlink app, will trigger the lights to change to a slow flashing red. At the critical battery level of 10%, the lights will change to a quickly flashing set of red lights. Quick flashing yellow lights indicate a communication loss. This can happen if your controller is unbound or not powered on yet. When all four lights are quickly flashing red during the startup process, this could be an, an initialization failure, and please contact customer support. I hope these visual representations of the LED indicators has helped you get a better understanding of what the X-Star is trying to tell you. This can be very important in some situations, such as flying without the camera attached. I always check my lights, and I recommend adding it to your pre-flight checklist. Let me know some ideas for future videos down below. My name's Tim, and I'll see you next week.